So we are very, very happy, and we are so happy that you all came out and supported all those athletes who supported us again. I want to say thank you to you. The Arnold Classic was back after years of being off because of the pandemic and things downtown were jam packed and that the Columbus Blue Jackets were home tonight as well. 10 TV's Richard Solomon was spent the night downtown as at the Arnold capturing all the sights and sounds. He shares why some people are saying this year's Arnold is setting the tone for future events. On the warmest day of 2022 so far, some people would argue it was filled with the most fun. The large crowds and muscle to match can only mean one thing. Two years ago, we were hit with the coronavirus and we kind of like, well, only allowed that 4,000 people here. But we said then, we'll be back and we are back. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back. You heard the man. People traveled from all over the world to experience the Arnold Sports Classic from fan favorites to new favorites that'll hurt in the morning for dragon loath it was his first time at the event like, crazy scene like bodybuilders seeing them in person is a lot different than seeing them on tv and but what he didn't prepare for was the downtown crowd that's actually pretty tough we got to drive around a block or two the streets were flooded with spectators and blue jackets fans parking was hard to find and if you paid, it wasn't cheap. But the busy streets make a crowded restaurant. It's an absolute surge to our business, um, especially, you know, such a protein-packed group of people. Chris Reisner is the assistant general manager at Bear Burger. He says this week business has been good, but seeing the city thrive again is a good sign of what's to come. But as long as you're out here doing the safe precautions that we need to do, just kind of keep, you know, safety in your mind, I think everyone will be all for having these conventions back. At the Arnold, Richard Solomon, 10TV News.